Okay, guys, now it looks like King may have a baby on the way. Now, of course, these are all speculations, but his ex-girlfriend did post something onto Instagram that had everyone wondering if she was pregnant with King's child. So basically there she's like realizing I'm gonna have two baby daddies and then she's doing all these faces like oh my gosh I'm gonna have two baby daddies. Anyways everyone in the comments were like is there a congrats in order and did King get you pregnant and then one of her friends stated that looks like you know I may have I'm gonna have three and then she put lol I made two friends. So we already know she has one. And then if she has two and she's not with King and then maybe three for another guy. Anyway, she says, I asked if he wanted his stuff. He didn't reply. So yeah, designer belts, Rolex, Benz, Key. What do I do with this ish? Now we know King the, did drive a Benz, which was Neek's car that she no longer has anymore. So if he left that key over there, then it's kind of irrelevant right now because the car doesn't, well, it's total. So she doesn't have it anymore. Then she said he left a Rolex and designer belts. Now I'm, I'm saying she's talking about King because King has all those things. So maybe he left all those things at her house and she needs him to come by and pick them up. But anyways, as always, I want to know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below. Now, let's get on to the next topic with Miss Deara. So if you guys did not know, Deer and Ken did go to Miami. I'm not sure if they were there to celebrate Valentine's Day or if they just took a little mini vacation or, you know, if they had business to handle out there. But anyways, it looks like on the way back from Miami, Deara was actually robbed. She went onto Twitter and she says, At Delta, I've been flying with you all for years and to a whole platinum medallion with hundreds and thousands of sky miles. I'm highly upset how someone can steal out of my check luggage almost thousands of dollars worth of goods run me my money asap now we know Deara has like millions of followers on twitter so delta actually did respond and basically was like you know have you filed a claim and she's like indeed but y'all are talking about four weeks to hear back i don't have that type of time she's like run me my coins right now omg like i'm wondering exactly what they stole out of her bag because we know she took some expensive things to miami hopefully none of her jewelry was in that bag she has chanel purses expensive shoes all types of things that someone could have stolen out of her check luggage which is absolutely crazy so anyways i hope she gets that resolved i know sometimes with the airlines they don't even if they at fault for something they don't want to give you the money that all your stuff was worth so hopefully if it was jewelry or something like that she had insurance on it okay so on to the next topic the prince family guys if you have not seen what's been going on in texas it's been absolutely crazy basically texas is having a winter storm that they are unprepared for it's been power outages people have been without power in like 19 degree weather the city is still not the city i'm sorry the whole state is still constantly losing power because the State officials were not prepared for weather to get down into the 19s or the teens or whatever because Texas has never had that type of weather. Anyways, a lot of people has been like of course losing power and their pipes have been bursting and a lot of other things well it looks like Damien Bianca may have fell victim to that because Damien went live and shared some information with everyone on some problems that he was having at his home. Fuck. 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 Oh shit, bro. I gotta go. Damn, man. Pray for the Prince family, dog. Pray for us. We gotta leave our house. We gotta leave our house. The firefighters on the way over here right now, bro. This shit crazy, bro. Our shit, our fucking pipes busted, and it's my straight gas. Fuck. We gotta get the whole, we gotta get the whole family out the house. Damn.
Fuck. 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 Hey, you put that over there, bro? Oh, shit. Almost fell. You put it over there? Yeah. All right. Fuck. Damn, man. Fuck. I ain't come on over here, bro. Fuck this shit. Fuck. Off damn near fail. They're here. They here? Look. Who? Oh, they down there. The pyramid. The Emily. Damn, bro. What the fuck? Oh. Man, what the fuck, bro? Damn, hey. We, we down here. Hey. They can't see us, bro. We down here. Damn, almost busted my shit. Fuck. They can't even see me, bro. I'm down here. I'm over here. Hello? Am I too short for y'all? Hello? All right, bro. Bro, am I too little or something? They can't see me? Yeah, we down here. Hello? Can they not hear me? Huh? Yeah, we we here. Yes, yes. Come here. My fucking eyes watering. I got no connection. At the wrong house. Fuck. I gotta get my family. Fuck them. Niggas. I got. I gotta pull out the driveway. For some shit, blow. Hey. I'm going to talk to y'all later, bro. I got it. I got to go with my family. Absolutely right. crazy what's been going on in Texas. I know Corey went live yesterday and his lights were out. And it seems like some things have been going on with other people like Emma and Vaughn. They were actually at the Prince family's house yesterday because their lights were out. And it looks like Damien and Bianca may have been having some issues with some gas in their house and they had to call 911. I'm just praying that everyone is safe. Seems like everyone got out of the house, which is awesome. Pretty sure Damien will be updating everyone on exactly what happened. Anyways, as always, I want to know what you guys think about all this down in the comment section below.